Hey YouTube, what's going on? Brandon here with another printer video. Today we've got the Kodak ESP Office 6150. Basically, if you're having any issues with your print quality or printing a certain color, this is a method you can use to go ahead and save yourself a bunch of money, uh, not having to send it out for servicing or repair and uh, or buying a new printer. Before I continue the video, if you end up finding this information helpful and you end up saving time and money or both, all I ask is that you donate to the GoFundMe account for this channel, which you can find in the description below. Whatever you end up donating, a dollar or two, basically to help the channel continue to grow and help people with their printer repair needs. Any donation would be greatly appreciated. Thank you. So without further ado, you're going to want to go ahead and open it up. Now I've already taken out the ink, but you're going to want to take out the ink from your cartridge. Luckily, these Kodaks. The print head comes right uh, in the middle right when you open it you're gonna go ahead and remove this take out the print head okay so basically what you're gonna use to clean this print head is pure isopropyl alcohol so you're gonna want to have a container just like this you're gonna want to put your print head in there and then you want you're gonna want to go ahead and submerge your print head in isopropyl alcohol Submerge it. Make sure it's submerged. Another thing you can do is you can go ahead and get the spray version. Now get the highest percentage you can get in isopropyl alcohol. But you can go ahead and spray this down as well. You can see the color coming out a little bit there. Basically your ink dries up in there and clogs it up. What you're trying to do is get this unclogged. Okay, so you can leave this here for 24 to 48 hours. And basically that's enough time for it to unclog after that you're going to want to dry it off completely before you put it back in and make sure that your ink is full make sure you have full ink because if you have you know ink that is running out that's going to end up being an issue for you so that's basically all it is guys some isopropyl alcohol with the container and uh, just a little bit of time like i said this does not take a whole lot of time Hope you liked the video. If you have any questions at all, go ahead and comment below. Make sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and until next time.